Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm doing some more of Horse Eden. So I have had a little bit of a read of the manual. I've also had a couple of people give me some really great tips. So thank you to everybody that shared some of those. So I'm gonna try and do a few more of these. So I'm gonna try the rules quiz. I haven't actually read the rules, but we're gonna have a guess, okay? Cause I'm gonna assume they're kind of similar um, to some of the other stuff. So let's go to the help and then the game quiz, game guide and tech the quiz. Okay, help, game guide. Okay, it's at the bottom. All right, let's see what there is. Okay, rules quiz. What is the maximum number of free accounts your high school can have? Um, I'm gonna pick unlimited because I think I seen it somewhere that it was unlimited so long as you were cheating. Um, I can't, or maybe it's three. I don't know. Let's try unlimited and we'll know soon if we got it wrong or not. I can't transfer ebbs between my accounts. I'll get my friends to do it for me. I don't know what ebbs are, but I'm going to guess that it's a bad thing. So let's like, no. I need a picture for my horse so I can find one on Google Images. Well, I did read it just somewhere that they were really against any kind of plagiarism. So I'm going to click no way. Since it's okay for my friends to send me ebbs, I will just have all my friends sign up and send me all their ebbs. I'm guessing no. I haven't a clue. I don't have a premium account, so I'll get a friend to rate my horses. Well, that sounds like I shouldn't do it, so we'll click no. It's okay to use my side accounts to pay for things in my main account. Well, that just sounds like multiple accounts on horse, so we'll just go with no way. What happens if I get busted for cheating? I would say I'd be banned for life. Let's try. Let's see what we got. Did we get them right? Do we have to go all the way down to the bottom to find out? Oh, okay. So that was wrong. We got the other ones right. Um... I'm going to pick three. Uh, what happens if you get busted for cheating? Um, any or all of the above. Okay, maybe that was it. Yeah, I did it. Okay, so I got 500 Eden bucks. Congrats. All right, what have we got? Free range. Okay, set free th three, set free three horses to the free range. That's like a tongue twister. Go to your horse's page and click the manager horses link and set free the horses. Note, don't set free any horses that you want to keep as setting. Free horses will remove them from the game. Complete. Okay, so I have to do this. I did buy a couple. Um, so let's go into the barn. I just bought a load of like really cheap ones. Uh, everybody said go get geldings and compete though. So I'm going to send away some of the fillies, I guess. I suppose they're the easiest ones to set free. So manage your horse. Um, set horse free? I don't know what that means. So I'm just going to click set free. Okay, your horse has been sent to the free range. Okay. Manage horses. Set horse free. What is this? If you no longer wish to own this horse, you may set them free to fend for themselves. The Karma Fairy will pay you a thousand for your adult horses and zero for your um for your yearling. Okay, we've got a karma fairy. The action is not reversible. So okay, well I am doing it because it's part of the Part of the quest, set horse free, set free. You completed a horse eating quest and earned 1,100 Eden bucks, okay. What's a new one, tack. Visit the tack shop, tack is purchased in the store. Go to the services store and click new tack button, okay. Services store and then we need new tack, so okay. Well, I did see something about this earlier. You can buy tack and it only lasts for a certain amount of time. You can put it on your horse, so. You've completed an Eden book, or you completed a horse Eden quest and earned Eden bucks. Okay, so uh, our sales are currently closed. What about use tag? Oh, okay. Uh, tag will return after we redraw the tags to work. Okay. Oh right, I can't buy tag at the minute. Something else going on, I think. Right. Um, visit the tag shop. Tag is. Tag is purchased in the store. Go to that and click the new tag button. Okay, well I did that, didn't I? I did that. So why hasn't it, like, I don't know, maybe I need to refresh the page. Oh, okay, I did. Breeding, breed a splash white foal. Splash white is a white pattern that your horse can have and the gene is SPL. So there's all these genes and everything and this like proper color genetics, which I think is really cool actually. I think it makes it a lot harder because obviously you could have a horse with the right genes, but you could breed it a hundred times and not get the foal that you want. So just like real life, I guess, which is kind of interesting. Um, so I don't know about that one. What else have we got? Breed a foal, foal with a premium rating. Well, I don't have, I'm trying to think, I don't have a mare that would be right, but what we could do is go buy a mare. Let's search horses. So 
because I did work out how to buy horses. So let me see. Um, we're going to want one that is a female. Um, so we'll go with a mare. Uh, we're going to want one that is over. How, how, what is it? how does this work? Oh, yeah. oh, okay. Right, okay. That's just the way it's laid out. It's really confusing. So over three. And uh, we want her to have a. Let's go with premium. I think it was just premium, wasn't it? Breeding full with a premium written. So we have a premium mare and we breed it with a premium stallion. I'm going to guess that we get a premium full. Um, we'll click search and see what we get. Uh, I want to sort them from highest to lowest. So sort by price, lowest to highest. Okay, because we don't have, we don't have very much to spend. So we got to make a count, submit. Why is nothing showing up? Um, for sale maybe? Maybe that's what I did wrong. Oh, okay, yeah, that was it. Right, we've got one here, it's 19. Right, so we could buy her. Um, maybe we should be better buying one that would do both of this. I don't know if that's possible. Um, it's because there's only some genetics that I understand and the more complex ones that you get into, I'm not so sure of. Let me see. Let's see if we can find a draft um, breed. So Irish draft horse. Submit. Okay. Oh wow, yeah, they are a lot more expensive. People said they're more expensive, but I, yeah, I see that now. That's very, very expensive. So this is a premium mare, isn't it? She should be. Um, okay, yeah. Right, well, let's buy her. Okay, let's hope we can breed her. And she hasn't been bred to I probably should have checked to see when she was last bred. Well they're quite old, so she's probably been bred then, so um we'll go to the breeding um where is it? Breeding centre. We want to try and get what do I say? Maybe we should gene test her. No. Yes, reload. Don't fail on me. Okay, maybe we should see if we can um she had a gene test. I don't look, doesn't look like she's had a gene test, so. Um, genetic test. Submit. Okay, let's see what she's got. Genetic test. Okay, um, so we need to do a splash. Okay, so she doesn't have a splash because she's like, um. Ah, uh, I'm trying to remember now and I'm forgetting. She is. See, this is now where I'm forgetting all of all of the terms that I should remember from biology. Uh, she's she's not dominant for splash white, so she's no splash white in her, and she doesn't have Tobiano either, so she is unlikely to give us either of those. But we just want to breed a premium full, so maybe we'll breed her to a stallion who is dominant for. Um, splash perhaps and see if, if we get lucky we'll try it anyway so we need to find um search horses and then find one for breeding so we need to find a stallion who's over three um all right we'll go for splash white because i think that's the right one that we want or we could do to be on but i'm going to go with splash white it needs to be a stallion could be any breed um gene tested yes because we want to be able to see um, for breeding, okay, and we want them to be premium or higher, so let's try that. Whoop. There we go, submit. Let's see what we get. Uh, let's check, check out this one. So he is gene tested, and no, wait a minute, no, he's only got one dominant gene for it. The other one's recessive. Recessive! I knew I was going to remember eventually, so he's not um, homozygous for this, he's heterozygous for splash white. Okay, okay. Right, I think. Um, right. Let me think. What do we need to do? We need to find something I think a bit better um, in terms of the color genetics, so let me see. I want to sort by lowest to highest and 
check that out and see if that actually would would do so submit right let me let's just open a few in a tab and see what we get so this one is gene tested and he is heterozygous as well so we want we want one that's homozygous for splash or tobiano i guess because we could try and sort of do those two things together so he's heterozygous as well so that's no use oh he's very pretty i think right genetic test um he's splash well there's a potential there that he could throw us but then he could also throw us one that doesn't have it so um oh this isn't easy to choose we need to find one that's got both of them um we need to look right we'll open a couple other ones this one this one we're bound to find something that's right All right genetic test so he's he's heterozygous as well um genetic test no he's not going to give us the right one genetic test see I, and i understand why it's really really difficult to um to do this to breed uh, the right colors that you want All right well We'll open a few more, and if we don't get somebody that's homozygous for Splash or Tobiano, we'll just kind of go with whatever. Okay, no, we'll not forget that one, because I want to try and get one or the other. Um, no, that's not going to be right. Oh, wow, they're pretty. They're very pretty. Genetics. Um, no. Let's see about this guy. No, he's not going to do it either. Genetics. No, he's probably not going to be what I want either. Right, we're going to pick from one of these ones. So this one, he's a chance that he could possibly throw us either. As long as the, if he throws the dominant gene and the mare, you know, is going to throw recessive both ways, it'll be fine, I guess. He's quite nice. Um, I really did like him too, but he... Right, we're going to, we're going to use him. Um, right, so minimum written allowed a eh, eh, eh. Okay, let's see what happens if we click breed. Um select Can we not Oh, we can't why can't we use the mare? Minimum rating a eh, eh, eh. I'm trying to remember what a eh, eh, eh was. Let's try a different one just to see in case it's um in case it's the wrong kind. No, can't click there either. Minimum written none. So it must, our mare must have already been bred with. Well, that's no use. Right, let's see. We'll go for a mare and we'll go with the same um, things and we'll click for sale and see if we can get one that matches up with this. Okay, there's one for 3,000 and she's 15. Right, open the page. Right, she has been genetically tested, so she's splash. Okay, so we can buy her her offspring she's just had a foal so that's not going to be any use to us at all really is it because if she's just had a foal we're not going to be able to use her to breed another one immediately um right let's see foals this year one oh okay you can tell how many foals they've had is it listed here either if we can find that out um Unbred. Okay, maybe that needs to be what we need to click on. Find something that hasn't been bred. Okay, Whisper Fire. Okay, let's see, what about this one? Okay, she's heterozygous for both Tobiano and White. Um, let's buy her. Okay, now we will go back and refresh the page with one of these stallions. Yes, I want to refresh the page. Okay, there we go. We can pick her. Right, submit. You, can, you have completed a horse Eden quest and earned 1,100 Eden bucks. Okay, congratulations. Right, did that? Let's go see what the full was. You've chosen to breed Quest of Kings, a lovely silver smoky room, girl Tobiano, splash white stallion. Okay, well we did that. Um, so have we got a full now? Let's go have a look. We're bound to have a new foal somewhere here. Is this it? Is it Colt? Is it the right one? Well, that looks like a splash white to me. 
Um, what is your horse, right? Um, genetic test. Submit. Let me see. Okay, well, we got Tobiano. Um, but we didn't get Splash White in that. So he's a brown room Tobiano. So did we manage to do some one of those? So we've got another quest for Sabino, for Splash White, and Brady Fall with a premium written. So did he not come out with a premium written? Or maybe we need to rate him? Um, hmm. No, I don't think we can, we can't um, see what he is yet. And I can't really see anything that tells me what he is, so. I don't know if we've managed to do that. Um, sign writer. Well, it's suggesting those. I can't really tell what level he is. It doesn't seem to say anywhere. I know that you can rate them somewhere, but it does not seem, doesn't seem to be giving me the option to do that, so I'm not really sure. Sport horse cult, okay. Let me see. I want to have a look at the pedigree and just have a look. So, um, horse, white, warm blood. Okay, so that's why he's a sport horse, because he's got all this, like, sport horse and warm blood in him. I see. That's kind of interesting, actually, to see, like, a bigger um, range of stuff. Something that I came across earlier, and if somebody can explain to me how to do it, you can brand your horses. So, only your horses can have that brand, and I thought that was really interesting, but I can't work out how to do it because it said you had to go into your account and do it, and I went into my account and it didn't give me an option to brand them, so I don't know if I need to be premium or something to do that. Um, so I was a bit confused about that, to be honest. Great Irons, Achievements, Awards, Manage Shows, Associations, no Manage. There's bound to be more information here to see whether I bred a premium full, but then I think if I bred a premium full, it would tell me that I bred a premium full from the get-go. Um, and there's nothing else there to tell me. I'm gonna geld him because, um, well actually, show page link, what does this mean? Oh, okay, this is the page for everybody else, let's see. Um, Hmm, I kind of wanted to see if it told me more about him in that respect, but it doesn't seem to. I'm still trying to like understand this game, and I did have a read of the guide earlier and I've learned a bit about it, but I still feel like really, really new to it. It is not easy, I think, but um, yeah, I, f I find it quite interesting at the same time, so. I do like the fact that you've got such a variety with the colours and I don't think you ever really know what you're going to get until you like really get a grasp of it and I don't feel like I've got a grasp of it yet, it's going to be a while before that happens. Um, but obviously if anybody has any more tips that would be great. Um, I appreciate those. But anyway guys, I will leave it there. I hope you said a lovely day. Bye!